Hi Arno, thanks for being here. We are with Arno from ReadSpeaker, uh, a solution that helps Moodle sites get text-to-speech functionality. And I'd like to hear a bit more on what's the problem that you solve and what's the type of users that you help, because it's more than what people would think in principle, I think. Definitely, and thank you for having me, Carlos. Uh, hi, everyone. So I work at ReadSpeaker, like Carlos mentioned. We provide text-to-speech technology, and this allows learners to listen to the course material, to the content within Moodle. Mm -hmm. So envision people on the go, on their way to class, mm -hmm. or at home doing a new onboarding course. And you know, kids are playing in the, in the background, you wanna focus, you have to learn, you have to read from maybe a small screen device like a cell phone or a tablet, then it helps to just put on a headset and listen to the content while reading along with the highlighted text. Mm -hmm. So besides all disabilities like dyslexia, like concentrational disorders, there's a whole bunch of people that just have an auditory preference. Mm -hmm. And we always call this the, the podcast effect. So if you give people the choice to listen to a podcast about a certain informative topic, or read a book about the same topic, well, nine out of 10 times, you know, people go for the easy route and listen to the podcast. They'll, they'll prefer the audio. And that's what we provide. So our technology allows users in Moodle to listen to the content, to give them that choice. Mm -hmm. And they can read along with highlighted text and all kinds of assistive features if necessary, but that stimulates them to visually and auditorily engage with the, con uh, mm -hmm. the content. Mm -hmm. That's yeah. wonderful. So I guess it's yeah. more retention and it's more flexibility Definitely. at the end of the day for the user. Yeah, so we, we want people to be more engaged and it's also scientifically proven that it helps concentration, helps retention of information and recollection of information. And of course, you know, that indeed improves study results, study outcomes. So yes, we, we also provide us as helpful for the end user, but it's also helpful for the customer, for the organization.